Oh my god, guys, look what has arrived. It is the freezer. I haven't switched it on yet because I had to wait two hours. Obviously, after transporting it, um, the guys arrived at half seven this morning. I was like, seriously, and there were two of the most chattiest fellas. Oh, I just wanted to do I just didn't want them to speak. I wanted them to deliver the stuff and go because I'd only drove, driven back from my mum's yesterday. So I was tired. So as you can see, there's Mr. Tony inspecting it. Are we looking at it? Yeah. Okay. So it has three drawers. And that's the instructions. I'm going to take them on. I'm going to take them on. I'm not going to take them on. I need more night, more sleep. I'm going to take them out. I'm going to switch it on. And then we are going to go to Iceland and fill this baby up. That is blocked off because there's no product. This down here is blocked off because there's no product. All the freezers are empty, even the ones that say ice cream are all blocked off. That is so creepy. Right, well, I guess we'll be going somewhere else for our shop as well. Okay guys, so we've gone into it's Iceland. Every freezer was empty bar vegetables. Vegetables and corn corn yeah like the vegan stuff and um, that was it. everything else was empty so we got a pack of six pack of crisps and pick a lily for my mother <laughs> that was it so, so we, love two, <laughs> we now need to go and still try and fill the freezer yeah i think um like i knew their products would be called. i didn't think they were shutting off whole freezer yeah <laughs> and like freezer aisles right so we're probably going to go where do you want to go aldi uh, dunn's 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 for a change okay we're heading to dunn's all right, guys, these are what I got in Dunn's to stock up my freezer. Now, we also did stop in middle, but I'll show you that in a minute. Just to show you a couple of non-food items that I did get. I did get these two jars of carrots. These are handy just to have in the press, so I don't mind having them. And then my mother absolutely adores pick a lily. So I decided to get her a big jar of original pickling so hopefully she's happy with that so then moving on to the freezer stuff so obviously the kids were excited so I said to them what you want the resounding answer was ice cream so I did get a lot of ice cream at the same time I also got stuff to have in my freezer so starting here I got the eight mini belgium chocolate selection these are like the magnum min minis so but they're dunn's own brand so i got a box of them these are empty because i've taken them out of the boxes because there's so much packaging on frozen stuff it's frightening i also got four of the chocolate chip cookie sandwiches i thought they actually looked really nice I wouldn't be an ice cream lover. Every so often I fancy an ice cream, but nothing major. So, got them and I got six of the chocolate and nut cones. So they're like the Cornettos, the HP Cornettos, but again, Dunn's own brand. And there is six in there. And then the last of the ice creams that I got was the HP Iceberg. Carl especially loves these. I would be partial to them myself, but it's only four in a box. And for the price, they're not really worth it, but they are because we don't get them very often. So then the other thing I got then was a pizza just to have in the freezer. 
I don't particularly like pizzas. I'm not a pizza lover. And I got a double pepperoni deep base. Seems to be favourite with the kids that and normally the cheese one but I got the pepperoni. I got some Irish whiting fillets in a breadcrumb. They are just so handy to have in the freezer. You can't go wrong with them like. So I was delighted with them I have to say. I also got some mixed vegetables. These are the carrots, peas and sweet corn. And they're the small little ones. So I love them for throwing into savoury mints, spaghetti bolognese, anything that I want to just bulk it up with a bit of veg. Always throw that in. I used to get it in tins when I had no freezer. But now I have a freezer. I can buy the frozen one. I got two bags of the baby carrots as you can see they were two for 280 it's the one veg everybody eats without complaint everybody eats them so i got two bags of them i also got this farm range taste the diff taste the goodness chinese style butter cheese balls again great to have in throw with sweet and sour sauce over them or curry sauce or a black bean sauce bit of rice you have a dinner made just always good to have in especially if people call unexpected and then from the same range i got the chinese style crispy shredded chicken in a light golden batter again that's them there again ideal to have in you know friends arrive up whatever and you're making the dinner always great just throw a sauce over it bit of rice you've got a full dinner and then I got a bag of chips. These are the fried chips, but it is going to go in the air fryer. They're not huge chips. I would have preferred bigger ones, but Kerry had picked them out and put them in the trolley, so just left them. And that is actually a very big bag. How big are you? 2.5 kg. Jesus, she must think we're only chips for the year. Anyway, so got them. I'll show you now what I got in little. So this is all I got in little. I actually was surprised. I thought I'd go out and I'd be looking to buy a whole lot more. Or, but there wasn't. I was like, yeah, okay. Maybe if I cook off some meat and stuff, I might put it in. But there was nothing overly impressive that I wanted to go, yeah, I'll keep that in my freezer. That'd be good to have. So, I don't know. Carl wanted these. Him and Haley had these before and they loved them. So they said, ma'am, you grab them in again. So this is the packaging. Actually, let's open here for a sec. So much packaging for such a little bag. Like, little bag is in there. And it comes with sauce. Curry dip sauce. That one's missing its lid, I don't know why. Like, always, never ceases to amaze me. The amount of packaging. So I'm going to throw that back in. But anyway, got two of those. Two of the chicken nuggets, sorry, a bag behind me just fell after fighting the life out of me. So I got two of them. Kerry asked for these, which is the crispy plantanas. They are bananas, but they're cooking bananas. And she loves these. So she said to me, will you grab them, please? So I was like, okay. So I did. I got her a bag of them that she can try in the air fryer or shallow fry them. I'm not sure which one she wants to do. And I got myself some breaded camembert with a cranberry dip i absolutely think this is gorgeous i love anything that or brie love it so that is literally what i got from little right guys so i hope you enjoyed that um i said i thought there'd be more i'd be dying to get into my freezer or maybe it's when you don't have a freezer you see loads of stuff you'd love to buy but now that i have a freezer i didn't see a whole lot i wanted to buy if that makes sense but at least now on the weekly shop I can buy frozen stuff because obviously it is quite it can be quite limiting but it's also very good for the fridge because um it keeps you on top of your fridge and having to use everything up because you've nowhere to put it you know freeze it off so that way it was handy and you only bought what you needed so we'll see how we get on um as I said I'm not overstuffing the freezer I'm not putting too much in there um 
we'll see what happens but yeah so i hope you enjoyed that that's what i got in duns and Liddles for the freezer and moving forward hopefully now we'll be able to buy some frozen stuff in with our food all right guys take care and i will talk to you in my next one bye bye